Y'all ready for this? Da na 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 na. What's going on, guys? It's your boy Nunzi. We back here with the uh, the crop and the modesty towel. Let's go. Keep it PG. Okay, guys. This is a great video. So listen up. Enjoy the show. Grab a snack. Uh, next 10 minutes here, I'm going to teach you guys how to properly train. And I'm not saying you don't know how to train. All right, all right, all right. It's easy now. I know you're working hard, but this is how you can really elevate your training. So I'm going to illustrate today with a squat. This is a great exercise to train like, a, like an animal. Before we get into the fun, though, we got to get a little bit of a warm-up going here. So I always get asked about the warm-up set. What's the idea behind the warm-up set? I'm going to break it down. So think of a race car as test laps. So it's before the actual race, they get to do a little test lap. So they're running around the lap, feeling out the race, right? This is kind of the same premise with a warm-up set. What I'm doing here is I'm feeling it out, making sure my muscles are getting primed, getting some good blood flow in my muscles, feeling my feet on the ground, keeping the core tight, the back flat, just kind of get myself primed, get myself ready for the rumble. You know what I'm saying? Get myself ready for the race. So there's no protocol necessarily for a warm-up set. You know, I like to do anywhere from two to three warm-up sets. Maybe I'm doing eight to 10 reps. The point here is not to blow the load, easy guys, but seriously, you wanna try and conserve your energy. The warm-up set is really about priming the muscles before we get into the, to the big game here. So, that was my first warm-up set. You know what, I think I'm gonna skip the second warm-up set because I'm not going super heavy today. And I really wanna show you guys uh, a proper set of how to grow your muscles to the new level. Hi-ho, hi-ho. Pop on the two plates, we go. Okay, so, this is it, man. This is your shot. How's that go, how's that song go? Mom spaghetti, she nervous, but on the surface she look calm and ready. <laughs> okay guys, so I'm gonna break down a set, a proper set. Please take some notes and uh, watch how we do it here. So I want everyone to really start training outside of the box. None of this two, three sets, 10 reps, which is great, but check it out, okay? Before your set, get your head in the zone, let's get excited. Get excited for the set. Take a nice deep breath, okay? Now before every set, we're gonna make sure our feet are nice and grounded. There's essentially five phases to a noisy set. Phase one is slow, controlled repetitions. Check it out, here we go. Let's go, Nunzi. Nice and controlled weight here. Drive up for one. Drive up for two. Drive up for three. Drive up for four. So really slow and controlled. These are your best reps, right? This is where you're just quality, time under tension. You're performing at your best. Inevitably, what's gonna happen is you're gonna get to like, you know, maybe a eight to 12 rep range. That's what I like. And I'm gonna start to die a little bit here. Gonna do a couple more. Let's get one more in there. And give it a rack. Okay, so check this out. We're not resting. This is called a rest pause. I'm taking a few seconds, gathering myself, catching my breath. Phase two of the Nunzi set is now a fast tempo. So we're gonna get now into a nice tempo where we're blasting them out. Blasting them out. Kind of giving them all you got. Giving them all you got. Give it. Let's go Nunzi, come on buddy. Give it all you got. Oh boy. Legs are getting shaky. One more. And shake it out, holy cannolis. So I can use another rest pause. Rest pause, fancy word for quick little breaks. Quick little breaks. Gonna try blast out another round here. Here we go. Right into it. How many do I got? Fast tempo. Phase two. All right. Shake it out. Maybe if I'm feeling it, like today, I'm feeling it because I'm making a video here. You guys are pumping me up. We're gonna hit one more rest pause. Here we go. Oy. Oy. Ah. Okay, phase two complete. All right guys, so phase three is extended sets. 
extended sets. This is where typically I'm gonna drop the weight to extend the set, all right? We're still in the one set wonder here. This is the Nunzi set. So, phase one, slow controlled reps. Phase two, all tempo using the rest pause. Phase three, we drop the weight to extend the set, and now we're back to clean reps again. The weight's cut in half. We should really be able to get some clean reps. And the fun thing about phase three is the isometric hold. We're gonna hold at the bottom, drive up and squeeze. 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 Hold at the bottom, and shake it out. And you're using rest pause throughout. You're going, you're giving it. Arnold had a great line, he said, if you could go into the gym and do one set and get more out of one set than homeboy there with a whole workout. One set mentality. That's what you bring to your workouts. You leave it on the floor. Here we go, still in phase three. Isometric holds, squeeze up, good. Squeeze up, good. Squeeze up, good. Squeeze up, good. Ah! Shake it out for a sec. We're almost there. Let's just say phase four. So once again, once we're just given all our, once the isometric holds are done, just give it all you got here. Empty the tank, phase five, body weight, baby. Body weight reps, give her, give her, give her. Once your legs fatigue, jumps, jumps, jumps. Come on, get into it, don't stop. I want you to train like Nunzi is there next to you. Three, yeah, two, ready? Phase five, the final hold. The final hold. The final countdown. Ah, ah, three, two, shake it out. So there you go, guys. That's one. <laughs> That's one set. I'll do this five times, and that will be a leg day. So once again, to break down a Nunzi set, there's essentially five phases, right? The first phase is the quality reps. Good quality reps. The second phase is no tempo. So just all tempo, sorry. Tempoed reps. Using rest pause throughout. The third phase is the extended set where you're stripping weight and then holding isometric holds at the bottom of the rep. The fourth phase is once again, more tempo, no holds, all tempo. And the fifth phase is the body weight, the jump squats, and the final hold. So that is how you train to grow muscle. Trust me, if you ain't sweating, if your heart's not pumping, if you feel like your legs are gonna collapse, that's what we're going for here. So you can apply this Nunzi set to any exercise. And I'm telling you right now, this is how you're gonna grow serious muscle and get thick. So make sure you give this a save, share your pancake you need. Get excited, guys. <laughs>